Sumter man sentenced to life in prison today after a jury found him guilty of killing his former girlfriend and her five-year-old daughter. News 19's Kaylin Hagwood is in Sumter tonight with the details. After a week-long trial, family of Cherie Bradley and Nevaeh Adams were able to exhale, breaking into tears after learning their loved one's killer will remain behind bars. We the jury unanimously find the defendant, Dante Maurice Johnson, Guilty. Dante Johnson received two consecutive life sentences for their murders, the jury taking just about two hours to find him guilty. Here's Bradley's brother. His actions were deplorable, despicable, wicked, less than a human. The prosecution was not seeking the death penalty by request of the family. During closing arguments, prosecutors said Johnson, armed with a large knife, stabbed Bradley 14 times, killed Nevea, and put the child in the trash. Then they say he confessed to it. I didn't kill those people on purpose. And then he asked the police officer, y'all hear me? And the police officer says, yeah, we heard everything you said. And then Dante says, I felt like I had to. But public defenders for Johnson tried to claim their client feared for his life and only had the knife for protection from her children's fathers, questioning why others didn't hear the crime take place. I remember when I lived in an apartment, I could hear everything that my next door neighbors were doing. It doesn't make sense. In the end, jurors rejected those claims. Sumter Police Chief Russell Rourke called the killings one of the most heinous crimes he'd ever seen in his career, with solicitor Chip Finney saying he hopes the verdict helps the community to heal. Reporting in Sumter, Kaylin Hagwood, News 19, WLTX.